when he my cookie got the better of me, so I asked this little girl I was going with to be my wife. She said she would, so I said I'd do, and I said I would if I just knew how saying I do was going to screw up the rest of my life. Well, the first few years went all that bad. I'll never forget the good times we had. And I'm reminded every month when I send her the child support. Well, it wasn't too long till the lust all died, and I'll admit I wasn't too surprised when I came home and found my suitcase out on the front porch. When I tried to get in, but she changed the locks, and I found this note take to the mailbox said, Goodbye, Turkey, my attorney will be in touch. So I decided right then and there, I was going to do what's right and give her her fair share, but brother, I didn't know her share was going to be this much. They gave me the gold mine, I got the share. They said they split it right down the middle, but they gave her the better half. Well, it all sounds mighty funny, but it hurts too much to laugh. She got the gold mine, I got the share. Listen, you ain't heard nothing yet. Well, they gave her the color television set, then they gave her the house and the kids and both the cars. But then they start talking about child support, alimony, and the cost of court. Didn't take me long to find out how far in the toilet I was. But I'm telling you, they must have made a mistake because they didn't take it way too much of this thing of age. Besides, everything I've had worth taking, they already took. She's looking like a queen on alimony, and I'm working five clubs eating bologna, asking myself, why didn't you just learn how to cook? They gave her the gold mine, and I got the share. They said they split it right down the middle, but they gave her the better half. Well, it don't sound mighty funny, but it hurts too much to laugh. She got the gold mine, I got the share. Hey! She got the gold knife, I got the share. You ain't kidding, I got the share. I don't have to worry about talking to billboard no more. I don't let my ex wife tell me. I'm going to be carrying food stamps. <laughs> That's not funny, huh? <laughs> then the judge starts talking about contempt of court. What did I say? Contempt of court. I gotta go. 